All right, guys, what's going on? Welcome in. So we have some breaking NFL news that just came out. It's looking like, according to Ian Rappaport, the Cleveland Browns are signing a core special teams player, Justin Hardy, to their roster. Now, man, I got to be honest with you. I'm pretty disappointed, right? I'm pretty disappointed that the Jets did not bring him back. Now, look, is the season over? Uh, did this ruin everything? Did this, you know, ruin all of Joe Douglas's acquisitions that he brought in this season? No. But it was one of those things where, in my opinion, it's a no-brainer, right, to bring a guy like this back. You know, obviously, we all have seen what he does on special teams. But beyond that, as far as leadership goes, as far as, you know, being a teammate goes, as far as accountability, as far as him being, you know, really a seasoned NFL professional, professional knowing how to go about his business, I really wanted to see Justin Hardy back. It's not like Hardy's going to be signed. And granted, look, the financials have not been released yet, but Hardy's not getting $10 million a year, right? The Jets could have easily afforded to bring him in. And uh, in my opinion, this is somebody who I really feel like, again, it's, it's, it's going to be overshadowed because of Tyron Smith and Mike Williams and whoever the Jets draft and whatnot. I get it completely, right? Rodgers coming back, but, you know, Hardy, and not to just lump them all into the special teams pool, but Hardy, Zerline, Morstead were the three that I'm like, okay, we can't really let these guys hang around on the free agent market for too, too long because they're going to get scooped up eventually. The Jets, of course, brought back both kickers, but, uh, or, you know, I guess kicker and punter, but Hardy was left out there. And uh, I don't know. It, it's just kind of, I don't know. It, it, it's not sitting well with me that, because, you know, when I think about Justin Hardy, obviously, you know, he spent so much time with the Saints, but he's been here. Like when I think of Justin Hardy, I think of like a, a leader, a great clubhouse guy, somebody that you know other special teams uh, special teamers can look to for advice. Somebody who's been around the game for a long time, he's experienced winning in New Orleans, knows what winning looks like. I think the Jets are going to miss him here, and I think the Cleveland Browns, right? If you're a Cleveland Brown fan watching this right now, you got a good player. You got a good you got a good football player who's going to make plays and not mess up. And when it comes to that Browns locker room, you're just adding another veteran piece another winner to the bunch. So anyway, let me know your thoughts down below in the comment section. Thanks so much for watching. And as always, go Jets.